Yeah, Bring Back News of the World was probably our biggest hit. I don't, I don't think it's our best song. Um, but I think if you uh, count in terms of YouTube views, it's actually our biggest song by some way. Uh, and I think it's because that campaign has a really strong message that we should bring back the news of the world. Um, you know, because it was genuinely a, a great newspaper for the people. And I think with it being closed down in such a ridiculous circumstance, I think it's depriving uh, the people of real news. You know, bring back news of the world, admittedly, not, not a popular that It was quite unpopular. Despite the fact that it was our most popular song, it was an unpopular cause. You know, no, I, I would say that actually our our new up and coming album is uh, a good starting point actually, because it's uh, completely different to everything else we've done, and you might like it. We're at the point now, as a band, as a unit, as a trio, seven years. We we've discussed this in quite a bit of detail. We are now at the point of a global takeover, potentially, you know... Globalisation is the key to the band. If we if we move around the world, we can actually spread our popularity around the world. Because and... Bob's been back and forth from Bosnia for years now. You've been back and forth over to the old Americas recently. Yeah, I've been so... to Americas. I've been to France as well. With us being in these countries, it gives us a presence there, it gives us a musical presence, and people will want to listen to our music more. Plus our next series of EPs is actually a global series of yeah. EPs. So Aberdeen sessions, and it was either the Bahrain sessions or the beer sessions. And yeah, we were thinking about going to beer. Um, to do some Danny sessions Devon. down in Devon. Yeah, and we were going to do the the Calgary, Calgary sessions, sessions on scene. after your appearance at the Calgary. after my appearance at the Calgary Folk Music Festival, which you will know, of course, if you've seen our uh, YouTube feed. Yeah. And then we're we're fairly open to suggestions from C onwards, so well, D, D onwards. onwards yeah. Yeah. But you know, if, if you come from a town and you're willing to have us record record at your place, your home, or wherever else. Um, as long as it's alphabetically somewhere we've not been. Yeah, then that's fine. Uh, just it, tell the band. If you really want, you can even appear on the EP with us. Um, you know, you, you, I, I, I can't see a problem with you being in this. We're open, open to outside influence, really. Yeah. I mean, not entirely on a communal level. It would be more... Uh, Steve and Rory, sorry, a Steve spearheaded pyramid with Steve at the top. Rory slightly above Rob, just underneath, yeah. something like that. And then, then the people. So if you'd like to be on an ill-fitting Garibaldi's recording, live recording, live jam, live jam. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, it, it would help if you are female and attractive um, and preferably single but you know I'll take yeah it's fine uh, because Rory's really desperate for uh, for anything that he can get um, yeah yeah w we've decided as a band um, that we should make a sex tape because if we look at the popularity that people get from doing sex tapes look at Paris Hilton, Kim Kardashian, China, Pamela Anderson, China, China. To increase our popularity of the profile, particularly online, uh, we should record a sex tape. Um, we've actually recorded three, and we've each done one. Um, so we set up all our instruments in the recording studio and uh, played some songs, which would be the soundtrack to us having sex. Basically, I can't see a problem with doing that. Philandera. Philandera. Philanthropy. Penis. Um, yeah, yeah, that's about it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Ill-fitting Garibaldi. Dot com. Buy our music. At wickedsteve twitter dot com dot user. T-I-F-G dot bandcamp dot com. T-I-F-G dash projects dot bandcamp dot com. Um, Bob uh, Hart <laughs> dot <laughs> Cut.
I'd say out of the three of them, women and fame more so than money. Um, I was thinking about basically tripping around the world, but acid tripping around the world. I, I think, mean, whether that direction is east or west, I haven't decided, but... I'd, I'd say, if anything, Robert's diminished things somewhat. Yeah, he has. Yes, well, Nora Jones is quite hot, and if you have the chance, you'd probably go for it, so... That's really young. For a, um... <laughs> the first place I'd guide them is if they're female into my pants, but, uh, you know, it's not necessarily always an option. We are actually What's still at suing, aren't we? Um, <laughs> I find for us personally, the message is always important. There's not always a message there. I mean, you know, sometimes we all out, just general good humour, good intention, sugar-coated race, and that is still fine. It's the penultimate, penultimate, pen penultimate tip track. The penultimate. The, the penultimate. The penultimate. Yeah. Yeah. What do you mean? The next to last tip track. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, sorry. I meant the, 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 the next to last ultimate tip track. Okay, the yeah. An ultimate ultimate track. Yeah, okay, yeah. I think Sugar Co is an is ultimate ultimate track. However... <laughs> <laughs> is that, is that a, a rap? Follow my Twitter feed.